How's it going, you guys? Um, I'm back with a video. Uh, today I want to do something a little different, still video game related. Um, but I just wanted to talk about my top 10 favorite PS5 games so far. Um, some of them came out on PS4 as well, but uh, I'm counting the ones I played on PS5. Uh, well, some of them came on PS4 and PS5, but at number 10, um, where is it? <clears throat> at number 10, I'm going with, uh, where, sorry, I probably should have this written down before I have it. Um, number 10 is going to be a sports game, MLB The Show 24, um, but yeah, number 9, I'll go with, uh, actually I actually have this game on disc, I played a good amount of it and I already love it. Final Fantasy 16. Great game. I think it's the first M-rated game Final Fantasy has uh, put out. But it's a great game. I love it. It's very, very fun. Very good story. Uh, combat's cool, too. Um, the other... Oh, that's nine, ten, nine, eight. I'm gonna go with. Yeah, I have it. Dying Light 2. This could be higher on my list. But I haven't played too much of it, but I just love it. It's just so much fun. This is gonna be 8 on my list. You know what, number seven, I'll throw this in there. Texas Chainsaw Massacre. It's an online game, but it's it's good. It's very fun. Uh, I think it's already dying, though, to be totally honest. It might already be dead. <laughs> football 25 I have two sports games on here these are the two that I play I've been playing the most and will be the show 24 and college football 25 so we got the top six here's the time for the top five Coming in at number five. I don't have it physically. I'm gonna, it's number five, it's Spider-Man Miles Morales. Now it almost feels like DLC, to be totally honest with you. But it's just so good. I really like that game a lot. Um, very fun, very cool. Combat's good, just like all the other Insomniac Spider-Man games. Um, For me, this is a remaster. Last of Us 2 remastered. Very, very good game. Story's great. Combat's great. Movement system's great. Everything about this game is great. It would be higher on my list, but since it's a PS4 game originally, and some of them are still going to be PS4 games originally, this is going to be four on my list. Three is the first one. That's the remake. Three is the remake. I don't have it digitally, 
but the first one is amazing. I mean, it's a PS3 game originally, so I don't know if I could put that on there, but it's a remake for the PS5. It looks gorgeous, um, but that game's just, I love that game. That's my top, th that's going to be in the top three, 100%. Um, <clears throat> let now, number two, here's where it gets tough for me personally, just because I could put so many games in there, but I'm trying to look, where's the game at? And you know what, my top, my top 10, top five is going to be different from everybody else's, so... I, I'm not here to judge anybody else's top 10. I'm not in here to, I'm not here to have, uh, I mean, I guess I'm basically begging for people to judge my top 10 PS5 games. Oh yeah, here's number two. Number two, uh, and these are just games in general. I'm gonna do a top 10 story games. Um, I would put Ghost of Tsushima number two, but just because I haven't played like at all, I can't because I'm putting the games that I played at least a couple hours of um, and got an, an early impression on it. Uh, but Ghost of Tsushima would probably be in the top three just because I know all the hype and I know people have played it. And it's just, I know that's a great game. Final Fantasy VII Remake, that's another game that I would put up there if I was playing it. Now, number two, I'm gonna go with Hogwarts Legacy again. That's another game I would put in my top five if, if I played it enough. But I love that game, and I only played like three to four hours of it. Maybe, no, probably like an hour. My second one is God of War Ragnarok. I've put like six, seven hours into it. Beautiful game, beautiful gameplay. Graphics are amazing. Um, that's going to be an all-time favorite for me. The new God of War games are just great. Uh, I have the third room. I have the third one, the remaster for the PS4 as well. That's a great game too. I mean, you really can't go wrong. Now I could put G same thing. I could put GTA 5 in there, but that's literally an Xbox 360 PS3 game, and it's been remade freaking 800 times. And you know, GTA 6 is coming out next year. So, you know what, I'm not going to do that with number one. Drum roll, please. Number one is going to be Spider-Man 2 by, by Insomniac. That game, I, I, I fell in love with that game. You get to play as Venom, spoilers. Uh, but that game is so much fun. I 100% completed it. Like, I'm obsessed with that game. That game can literally I just I need them to uh, I can't wait for the Wolverine game that's a game I can't wait for <sighs> I need that game to come out and then I need them to make a Spider-Man 3 just keep making Spider-Man games make them as long as you can because those games are they're gonna one they're gonna sell like hotcakes too they're just great overall games like I love just going around the city as Spider-Man using the different suits you know, and 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 then in Spider-Man 2, you know, you, you get your Venom suit, blah, 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 blah. Different variants of the Venom suit with uh, uh, Peter. And, you know, you still got your suits with uh, Miles as well. Um, but the fact that they also added the black Sam Raimi suit. Uh, a Raimi. Uh, I forget how you say his name. But the fact that you have his Venom suit in there just makes it a whole lot cooler. Um, granted, Spider-Man 3 is probably pfft, like low on my list of Spider-Man movies. But that suit is goaded, in my opinion. That suit is just goaded. The aura of that suit is just, it's just, it's unmatched. So, uh, but yeah, it's a great game. I just can't say enough about it. Ooh! Well, I could have put Red Dead Redemption 2 in there as well. I played a crap ton of that game. Uh, but that'll be on my top 10 favorite uh, 
story games for the for PlayStation. So, all right, well, uh, we're in ten minutes here, and I gotta get ready for work. So, you guys have a great day. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what your top five, top ten favorite games are on the PlayStation, Xbox, whatever console you're on, Switch, whatever. All right, you guys have a great one. Have a great day, and enjoy your week.